Welcome back to Is It Playable? In this video, we'll be taking a look at whether .hack mutation is playable with PCSX2 within RetroArch. Now, honestly, when it comes to these .hack games, I don't remember the order in which they go. I'm pretty sure it starts at um, Infection. And then as it goes further along the alphabet, in terms of the starting letter, they're the later ones, so the last one in the saga is Quarantine, I think. Because this is dot .hack mutation, it doesn't say what part it is. It's a bit of a pain. But yeah, I think it starts with Infection, then it's Mutation, then Outbreak, then Quarantine. Hmm, maybe, I could be wrong. Probably am wrong, to be honest, but whatever. Alright, we're back to this wonderful guy. Hi, IB. That's fine. What level are we starting at this time? That's that's what's going to tell us everything. Yeah, in Outbreak we started at level 40. If I start at like level 20... The day that he first played is, that the, is that what players have to... Like, in all of them? Ooh. This may actually come after Outbreak. Do I have to check the news again? I don't. Nice. Highland City. Dun. Is that Lorieg? And when the O server. Whoa. Hmm? We are, it feels oh, wow. Ah, uh, okay, this is looking... We're level 30. There we go. So yeah, it seems that might actually be the case. Not certain, though. Johnny. My name's Johnny, the stray grunty. I'll die if I stop. Stop talking to me. <laughs> I'll die if I stop, so you can talk to me. Jeez, okay. Yeah, I just want to go in here. I don't want to do... I mean, if I do random, I'll end up with one where I'll get my ass kicked again. Bursting, passed over, Aquafield. Battle level, 17. Holy ground, 16. Sea of Sand. Fort Walls. I mean, half my level should be fine, right? I should be able to survive. Sure. Yeah, I don't know why when it came to... I think it was Volume 3? I cared way too much about trying to do the story that I ended up making no progress. In the video it doesn't show because I cut half of it out. But yeah, I was trying to make progress with the story for some reason when, when it comes to testing the playability of a game, the only thing I really need to do is get in combat. I'm also noticing there's a bit of warping that happens. I don't think that's emulator specific though. That looks really weird. Yeah, it just makes more sense to get into combat first. Because that's like... I would I would argue that combat in this game is probably the most intense thing that happens. I have like claws. Are they claws? Oh my god, they are claws. Not bad. Grant mints. Oh, the enemies have spawned. Battle mode on. Hey, this thing again. Not again. 38. Jesus. Gandon. I think... Magic Tolerate. Toler to to tolerant. Sled Dog. They did. I do find it weird how there's no, like, combo. Yeah, I don't know. It could be just something I'm missing. But the combat, it feels real weird. It's not bad, necessarily, but whenever you attack, you only attack once. It's just really strange. Hmm. Go on, give me more combat. And get out of here with the gruntments. Well... They make the same noises as the bloody monkeys from Ape Escape. 
Oh, Ape Quest. I'm more familiar with Ape Quest uh, personally. Staccato. I can't use it. Oh, is it because they were too far away? Staccato! Get owned! Nice. Ooh. Fire Tempest. 150 health. Wow, that's quite a bit different. Yeah, compared to when you're level uh, 40. <laughs> oh, was it 50? No, it's 50. Yeah, when you're level 50, you're able to just do anything. Oh, your uh, HP. You recover 400 at a time. These things still kind of suck. Just in terms of health. They have a lot. Ah, oh, they got me. Oh, god, that was spooky. Yeah, there's like nothing I can press. You need a party member. It's weird. I also find it very strange that you can... First person. The camera. Not bad. It honestly... As weird as it is, it reminds me of um, the first person mode in Final Fantasy XV. Like, it works, and it's quite cool in some scenarios, but for combat, it's terrible. Because you can't tell when something's behind you or whatever. There we go. Oh, it's like a mage. On the back of the sled dog. Get owned. Oh, there's more. Hey, douche. I don't want to do that. Plus also, in like... In first person mode, you can't tell what you're doing. You just see a camera, and then the enemies die. Yeah, this seems perfect. Zero dips. Not even any dips when you come in or out of combat. But again, uh, when that came to... I think it was... Reminisce? That was only in the first battle, so I can't really keep dogging on that. Return to town. Not bad. Hmm. Yeah, I'm pretty pretty happy with that. So I would have to say that Dot Hack Mutation is playable. So that's going to be the end of this video. Thank you so much for watching, I hope you have enjoyed. If you did, be sure to like, subscribe, leave suggestions for games you want to see, and until next time, take care.